cake is so good. Best cake ever. It's nearly gone. I oh my gosh, who's gonna have the last bit? I wish I could just make lots of cake out of that little bit. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. Wait. Hey, there's a guy in the Bible who does that. Jesus did it. We gotta talk about this. <laughs> so, in the old days, there was this guy. His name was Jesus. You will probably know him. Everybody knew him. He was pretty famous. Mm -hmm. He was kind of like a celebrity in those days. And he had his disciples, who were his friends, that stayed with him. And on one day, he had a whole group of people. There were like 5,000 people following him, and listening to what he was talking about. Is a lot of people. A lot. And so, because everyone was listening to what Jesus was telling them, they were following him for the whole day. And so everyone was so tired and hungry. And so the disciples, Jesus' friends, they were kind of like, mm, maybe we should just let them go home so they can eat and rest and then come back another time. But Jesus was like, nuh-uh, they're not going home. They're staying right here. And we're going to feed them right now. And guess who's going to do it? The disciples. And the disciples, they were like, what? How are we going to feed all of these people? We have no food. There's no restaurants in that time. There's no Uber Eats that they could have done like there is now. The disciples were so confused. But there was a little boy. And this little boy had his little lunch. And it had five pieces of bread and two pieces of fish. And that's not very much. Like, they were trying to feed 5,000 people. That is not enough for that. Like, everyone would be having that much. But they took it to Jesus anyway. And Jesus thanked God for the food. And then he gave it to the disciples to share with the people. And when the disciples did share it with all the people, everybody had enough food. They just kept giving and giving and giving all the food out until everybody was full. Everybody was so satisfied and their tummies were so full that nobody needed to eat anything else. And <laughs> not only did everyone have enough food, there was also leftovers. Twelve baskets Full of leftovers. That is a lot of leftovers from two pieces of fish and five pieces of bread. So we can see how powerful Jesus is and how he provides for our needs. Yeah, and this story just shows us how much we can rely on God because he will give us everything that we need. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>